do you? Mr. Chapman's advertising for a medical secretary. And you're applying? Mm. I didn't realise you knew word processing. There's nothing wrong with a bit of healthy ambition. There is if you've got my qualifications. Well, what are your qualifications? Mother of four, divorced, third prize in the WI sponge competition. I expect it'll go to some floozy from computers and the medical records. Do you want the bad news or the good news first? Well, I could do with some good news. Well, the good news is that there's a vacancy in the medical records department. And the bad news is because she's moving on to the job of Julian. Look, Norma, you should try night school. Learn basic computing and keyboard skills. No, school. it's too late. Why? I used to drive a milk float. <laughs> if you'd have told me that I'd learn to get people breathing, get their hearts going, deliver babies, wind up guts, repack brains. Norma, any old dog can learn new tricks. Old dog or young dog, learn some new tricks. Give yourself a second chance. Maybe you're right. Phone 0800 100 900 for advice. And there's further information on CFAX page 628. Later tonight at 11.40, we meet a group of craftsmen who gave themselves a second chance. Public Eye on BBC Two now brings to light the disturbing increase in the activity of professional car thieves. And while the last thing they want is to be caught in the act in half an hour here on BBC One, we meet many innocent folk who were. Before that, Alf seeks medical help, but for whose benefit? Now my old darling, they've laid a 